cable travels up through the frame back behind the motor. It's clamped down with a uh, cable clamp and a standoff. I'll leave an item list in the description. I'll also put two tie wraps on the front and back just in case this thing gets greasy and it happens to want to slide forward or backwards. But the main reason behind this choke cable is if the uh, button to stop it fails, I have a backup plan. And what I ended up doing is I bought this cable and then once I measured it out, you pour, you pour, you pull the core out, which is this piece right here. Measure it to the length that you need it as far as the actual cable, this piece here. And then use a rotary tool and cut it in half. Then stick the uh, wire or the core back in and then rebend it. And that's pretty much about it.